All right, so we had a little bit of an incident last night, early, early this morning, uh, one fifty in the morning to be exact, and uh, there was only one response to give for what goes bump in the night, I guess you'll say, and uh, I just wanted to stress to people the incident. First off, turned out okay. <clears throat> Nobody was um, physically hurt, I guess you'd say. But uh, I just wanted to stress the point of staging. I've talked about it before. Having stuff ready when you need it right away. And being able to get to it, use what you need for the situation and I watched uh, Modern Refugees video earlier today too and talking about not everything has to be you know 110% when something happens and I definitely do agree with that I would prefer not to go red hot lethal madness every single time something crazy happened um, the situation this morning uh, it was kind of needed Shall we say, uh, come on, people, you gotta see the way some of these fools drive. <laughs> Doing videos when you're driving can be irritating sometimes. But uh, <clears throat> even though it didn't come to that, it's, it's good to have different levels uh, that you would go through. You wouldn't, first things first, is not always just draw up and this is how we're dealing with the situation. You gotta start talking down you gotta you gotta there's gotta be levels to everything I mean if someone's breaking in or whatever it might be a little bit different you can still shot them down hopefully uh, make light very bright on them hopefully and you know you won't have to go to that level but we've talked about non-lethal uh, ways of dealing with problems too even as far as like pepper spray or something like that <clears throat> depending on the situation hopefully you won't have a situation that you'll have to go lethal with, but being ready for everything, and when I mean everything, I'm talking about every situation you could possibly think of and every different level of that situation. Um, so not having to go to the red hot, but maybe have have everything set up right where you need it. I should probably do a video at some point. Maybe I will in my bedroom but the wife gets all crazy. <laughs> like, that's my room. I was like, okay. But I have stuff set up to where I can get stuff right there. I can um, hop up and be to more stuff. Whatever the situation entails, whatever it is, uh, everything's ready to go. So I just wanted to stress that just because you'll find out if your stuff works at the wrong time if you have never used it or never had to it was very easy for me when i woke up this morning it's not very easy for me now i'm extremely tired but it was just the simple fact that i could pop up i was already there i was already ready i beat any kind of time where people are like you need to get to the door about 15 seconds uh it was about three or something and it was uh pretty quick but um everything's good other than that i just wanted to stress you know run through your stuff uh, put stuff where you think you'd want it and then pop up or every morning when you hop up oh can I get this that that the other thing can I get over here or get to a spot where I need to be run through it a couple times so you know okay boom I got this some people might want to throw the plates on even if they're not connected just throw them on and run to whatever the situation is who knows some people got a bat sitting there some people got a ASP baton some people like brass knuckles uh worst comes to worst have a little bit of pepper spray something like that but Practicing in your house, other people don't know your house like you do, is another thing too. So you've got a huge advantage right off the bat for, right off the bat, for odds being in your favor. I know you might be caught by surprise, but run through this kind of stuff because uh, strategy and and um, practice is going to be huge. That's going to be the thing that ends up saving you. you. You know, even like Bruce Lee used to say, "I'm not afraid of the guy who knows ten thousand uh, techniques. I'm afraid of the guy who knows three and he's done them millions of times. So he can get those three techniques on anybody, right? Just go through it. Practice. Any questions? Let me know. Any um, 
thoughts on any training or if you want to hear anything else about something like that or staging, uh, let me know. And we will see you soon. Thanks for watching.